Hi community, this is going to be a pick a pile, okay? So, you know, as usual with pick a pile, I'm gonna have everything um, out so that we can see what's going on. There will be no guiding energy. The guiding energy will actually be the card that I pick, okay? All right, uh, thank you so much. One more, ooh, ooh, don't wanna see it. Uh, okay, I don't know if you saw it, so I'll leave it alone. That was a beautiful card, though. I was excited about that one. How's everybody doing? Don't forget to hit the like button and hit the share button. Please share, share, share. I do shorts now. Uh, this will be a 50-50 pick a pop. Um, I do shorts now, so, you know, hopefully my shorts are getting to you. I'm just starting to enter the algorithm a lot. Um, so... You know, it, it's like when you enter the algorithm, you you got to go through the moment where you get like two views, you know, but it's as the videos continue, I'll be more in the algorithm. But thank you for your support. Okay. The two views. I love it. Thank you. Okay. Please energetically pick the pile that you want or that you are energetically drawn to, I should say. You should see community dog. She's just looking at me. Okay. All right. So let's begin. The other video I had forgotten to wash on camera, but even if I'm not washing my hands on camera, I know that I'm doing it before the reading. Okay, and saging is already done. I try not to sage for each meeting, uh, each reading, because that stuff is powerful. <laughs> um, I energetically am going to choose the one to begin with, and I'll choose this one. Um, I don't always energetically choose, begin with the first one. So that's the one I was drawn to, though. Okay, let's see. All right, your spirit animal is an orangutan. Working to live joyously, not living to work. Okay, so we got some energy of some people having to um, put things in perspective, basically. Right, put things in perspective. Ten of coins is on the bottom. Okay, let me just cut this deck a little bit because it's been used a lot. <laughs> this is my number two deck, right? Remember in the beginning? I didn't, this, I've always liked this deck. I've always liked it. I like the energy on it. Um, and of course my deck, but I was auditioning other decks. Um, I still will use the Rachel True deck and, you know, um, it's just some decks uh, require a lot more, um, like studying, um, because they change the meanings, um, when they change the cards. So, Okay. Thank you, Divine, for all this energy. Thank you for this beautiful, beautiful day. It is gorgeous out there. It's a normal fall day. I mean, it's beautiful, okay? I love it. Me and Community Dog were out there. We didn't even want to come home. <laughs> we did not want to come home. <laughs> all right, may I have another energy, please, on this? Okay, working to live joyously, not living to work. Again, putting things in perspective, learning that there's time for you to say no, okay? Or I'll do it later, right? So that's what I'm getting intuitively from this card. People are learning to say no. Boundaries, that's it. You're putting boundaries up, okay? Good for you. There we go. Six of coins. Okay, that's the problem. All right, so you're worried about your finances and you're worried about, um, you have responsibilities, whoever this is. Uh, it's too many cards. Uh, you have responsibilities. You have children, animals. There's some some people or, or persons are relying on you, okay? So you're learning. You don't really have it right now to give, right? You can't really share it right now. Um, Ace of Swords, there we go. Um... Right, so six of coins and upright is willing to share. You see how he has all the coins and he's giving it to the gentleman that's on the ground begging or with his hand out, extending his hand, I should say. Extending his hand to him. Um, and he's dressed very nicely. It came out this way. 
right? So that's not your full situation. You are still in emperor, I would call it, or page energy. You're still in that, that, that night energy, if you will. You're still in it. But right now it's a little harder for you. It's just a little harder, okay? I see someone pulling um, extra shifts, someone coming up with projects at work, um, so that they can keep their dreams alive, right? There's a lot of, uh, intuition, intuitiveness going into someone's job. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Wow. Every card is upside down. Seven of cups. Oh, okay. Good. Nine of cups is not. Hmm. All right. So we have seven of cups in the upside down in the reverse. Um, you know, so that's sacrificing, Okay, nine of cups is the ultimate, is your love. There's only one more set of cups, which is a ten of cups, okay? Um, so yeah, you have a lot of energy, a lot of love in what you're doing. Ace of swords in the reverse, okay? Ace of swords in the reverse. Um, you know, you it, it's like you have the best ten of coins in reverse. You have the best of intentions, but right now finances are not there for you. They're not, and they're bothering you, but your love and your, your family, your background, that's something that is actually carrying you. Okay. Um, so you can, you know, you, this is representing your accomplishments that you can accomplish something. Um, stay focused. Okay. Your family loves you, whoever you're providing for. They love you for what you're doing, okay? They recognize that you are sacrificing and you are doing everything so that they don't have to want for anything, okay? So don't think it's going unnoticed, okay? Don't think it's going unnoticed. Um, if you want to say something to them, you know, I, I, I wouldn't. I wouldn't talk to anyone right now about how your emotions are. Because your emotions, because you're working so much, um, because you're working so much, it's going to come out wrong, right? It's going to come out and it's going to, uh, it, it's going to, it's going to offend. That's the only way I can tell you. And you know, guys, I'm a straight shooter, right? I'm, I'm a straight reader. I just let you know, especially intuitively, when I get what I get, I just let you know. Okay, so that's the only way I can tell you. It's going to come out wrong. Uh, don't speak to anyone about how you're feeling right now. You know, other than, of course, you know, if there's an issue, bring it up. Um, but just don't... I wouldn't get into any, like, heavy conversations, right? Because emotionally, you can't handle it right now, okay? Um, congratulations on someone... Right? Ace of Swords in the reverse. We I don't think we've ever gotten Ace of Swords in the reverse. That's a pregnancy. All right. Congratulations. It's a pregnancy or an expanding of a family. Congratulations. Okay. And here, um, be careful that because like like I said, you're trying to provide. Yeah, that I did say it already. Yeah, you're right. Um, sorry, I just had to remind myself you said it already. But you know how my memory goes since this accident. Um it reverses 10 of coins. Um, try to avoid thrill seeking activities. Try to avoid that, um, like gambling and, and things. Cause you have a, a family increasing here. Okay. And that's where your love is coming from. That's why you're trying to work hard. That that's it. That's why you're trying to work hard for this family. Things are tight. It's increasing, but you love your family. Okay. Um, I would just say maybe keep a journal. Keep a journal of how you're feeling and maybe have your loved one, because you are in a relationship, have your loved one that you're living with read your journal if you need to address something. Um, this I'm getting, even though these are male energies, I'm getting this is a female energy, okay? Or someone has, yeah, female, This the person's expecting a family. Or a feminine energy, a man who is, um, a, a male who may be sensitive, um, a male who is um, in tuned with his feminine side, a female who is ultra feminine. Okay. That's who I'm reading this for. Okay. Um, it's, if it's a female, if you're a female, uh, biologically, I guess, uh, female, because you're expecting a baby. Okay. 
um, you're expecting a baby or your family is increasing. I'm not seeing a marriage here. I'm seeing your family is increasing. Okay. Um, that's what brought on the six of coins as the problem, the money. Okay. Don't worry about it. Don't, you know, I always say when it comes to babies, family and expansion, the Lord has, or divine has given it to you. So therefore you will be able to do what you need to do to provide for it. That's how I feel. Okay. So don't worry about it. Page of swords in the reverse. I'll put that on ace of swords. Page of swords in the reverse. Um, yeah, you're no longer watching people. You're not looking for, you know, validation. You're, it's almost like, it's, it's almost like you're like a grown up and I don't want to say that. And I'm not saying that to be, you know, upsetting to anyone, but that's the energy I'm getting. You're finally getting into that phase of life where you're like, you know what? I can do this, right? I can do this. And because I can do it, um, yeah, because I can do it, I'm, I'm going to be okay. Right? So that's the energy. Okay. All right. Pile one, take a look and then I will move on to pile two. Let's see how many minutes we're at. Okay. We're at 11 minutes. This is a long video guys. Sorry. <laughs> Okay, pile two, you are the candle from 99 cent store or from Dollar Tree, I should say. Okay, you're up next. And yes, we're going to do another Dollar Tree video. I'm actually going to be filming one. I might film it tomorrow. Okay, because guess what? The November table is coming up. October table was struggling. I'm, I'm going to be honest with myself. Okay, I just know how to be honest. My October table was struggling. I don't know. I think it was struggling because I was struggling. <laughs> Because remember, I was in a lot of physical therapy in October. So I think it's struggle because I struggled. So we will not have struggle table anymore. Okay. All right. So let's move on. Okay. You are the moose. You are the moose. Okay. Pile two. With self-reliance and measured patience, adversity will be the outcome. Or will be overcome. Right. Okay. So... Struggle and I'm hearing struggle no more. That's what I'm hearing. Struggle no more. So, yeah. So, Hermit came out this way. So, that is your problem. Uh, Hermit in the reverse, too. Uh, you're not in Hermit mode. You're kind of out there. Um, but you still have Hermit energy. Um, meaning that's like a person, you know, in a party, walking around. They're in a party, everyone's having a good time, but that person is to the side, not even on their phone. They're just standing there. That's that hermit. Okay. All right. Self-reliance and measured. Oh. Okay. All of those cards fell out and only one fell on the floor. <laughs> All right. Sometimes with adversity or with problems, we do have to go into hermit mode um, because we have to. We have to solve the problem and the problem can only be solved internally, right? So it only can be solved internally. So we have to begin to silence ourselves, look around and figure out what the problem is. And if it's us, we have to fix it, okay? So that hermit, as the problem. Okay, let's see what's going on. <laughs> These cards and the upside downs. Oh my goodness. And it's not. Oh, look at that. Ten of Cups is on the bottom. Not in the upside down. Okay. Yeah, it's not the whole deck. It's just this. Okay, Eight of Cups. All right, so you were supposed to walk away, but you didn't. So you are. Um, this is a relationship reading. So you are sticking it out. Okay. Uh, yeah. King of Cups is here. Okay. Let me show you your cards. So you have Eight of Cups in the reverse, right? Eight of Cups is walking away. You're in the reverse. You're not. King of Swords. Okay. You're kind of backbiting, kind of nasty. Um, King of Cups, which you still love. 
right? There's your relationship's going through a difficult time right now. It's going through a difficult time. You're wishing for your ten of cups, though. You are wishing for that. Um, I see a couple working on something together, right? You're working on something together. Uh, right now you're just in that energy of you know when you're fighting and you're not happy with each other, but you still love each other. You know, they make a lot of TikToks on that. You know, the pettiness and stuff. That's where you are um, in your relationship. You did have an option to walk away, though. That's important to say. You did have that option. You chose not to. Okay? I'm getting this is a family situation. Right? You were asked to have patience. And actually, this card should have came out on the Eight of Cups in the reverse. You were asked to have patience, so you did not walk away. Okay? I'm getting a family intervened here. Mother, father, sister, brother, cousin. Somebody intervened in this. You know, somebody came in between it. Meaning, somebody came to you and said, like, don't, don't walk away from this person. You know, you have fault too. Like that, okay? I, the higher font should have came out, but you haven't learned a lesson yet. You're still in this upside down hermit. Um, yeah, you're just, this is cups energy. You're just in love, okay? Page of cups goes on your king of swords. So even though king of swords right now, you want nothing to do with this person. You are not happy with them. Uh, you know, I don't see you being intimate anywhere. So there's a lot that's been put on hold in this relationship right now that happens in relationships. But, um, that was cool. <laughs> but, um, you know, you're going to come at it. Oh my goodness. Look at that, guys. This can't... Oh my... Congratulations. I see... Uh, this is going to work out, whatever this is. It's going to work out. I'm glad you didn't walk away. I'm glad. Your Ten of Cups. This person is your Ten of Cups. You're getting that Ten of Cups. Uh, I'm seeing... Um, not seeing marriage, but I'm seeing a permanent union here. It could be permanent unions do not have to always end in marriage. A permanent union can be, you know, um, talking of family expansion, buying a house together, that kind of thing, right? That's what I'm seeing here. Um, I don't see the marriage card out here, but it's not far, right? Because you're in, it came out on, Ten of Cups came out on King of Cups. So you stuck it out in this relationship, even though you're in this sideway hermit, sideways hermit mode, Right. Um, and if I'm reading it, which I let me read it directly from the book for you. Um, what that means is even though it's a sideways, it comes out in reading as opposite, right? Which is uncertainty, depression, and doubt, right? That's yes, that is your energy now. Absolutely. Because this relationship you wanted to walk away from and you didn't. So that's a normal feeling. Right? Whatever issue was the problem, it has not resolved itself. That is normal. Okay? So don't take it like, oh gosh, you know, I'm I'm depressed. And yeah, because you're in love, right? That's what happens. You're in love. Um, it's more doubt I'm getting. Like you you did not walk away and you were trying to think why. <laughs> like you're trying to convince yourself. Like I said, I see a family member coming in here. There's intuitively, there's a family member who intervened on behalf of your person, okay? And it worked, it worked. And remember it says self-reliance and measured patience, adversity will be overcome. So this is basically saying this relationship, it is your 10 of cups, congratulations, okay? It's relationship drama, you love the person that you're with, you absolutely love them with all your heart, they love you. Just right now y'all have a hurdle to get over and guess what? You're going to get over it because you chose not to walk away. All right. Thank you. I'll let you look at your spread for a little bit and then I will be done. Don't forget to follow me. I am also on TikTok and I am on um, Instagram. Um, Community Dog has her own page um, on TikTok. She is, I think it's JGirl830. I may have to change that name. Um, but that is basically, I think, hers. But she is on, thank you, Spirit. I guess that is it. Uh, she is on TikTok. She has her own page. And Kitty has his own page. Well, that's not true. Kitty shares a page, which is Community Cat. Community Cat shares a page with uh, Community Dog. 
They both have shorts that are out um, and they're doing very well, okay? So we're on all social media. Um, I am going to start adding other social media platforms. So as I'm going to start opening up personal readings for um, my YouTube subscribers for the community, um, I will start opening those probably in March or April of 2023, okay? All right, so here's your spread. This is a beautiful spread. This is absolutely 100%. This is gorgeous. I, I love it. I'm jealous of it a little. <laughs> Okay. Um, yeah, yeah. I'm really excited for you. You chose not to walk away. You're looking forward to more better days, to happiness, to more adventures. It's, it's on its way. It's on its way. Okay. All right, everyone enjoy the rest of your beautiful, beautiful Thursday. And I will see you again for Friday. Bye-bye.